Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Erwin Litvak. On today's video, we're going to the best dessert spots in New York City. I'm running out of time, every day goes by so fast. And every moment counts, baby, I don't wanna miss a thing. We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars Or hang out in hotel bars, driving somewhere in your car We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars Under the stars What's going on guys? We're back. We just went to Doe in Brooklyn, which serves handmade donuts. I got Stan over here, who you actually guys might remember from our All You Can Eat video, and I will definitely link that up top. We got four donuts here, and we're gonna showcase each one, tell you guys what we think about them, the price, the taste, and then we're gonna rank them in order. Let's do it. So, Stan, which one do you wanna start with first? Probably not the big attracting all the bees right now because you know. all the sweetness going on over here. No. But, get out of here. Uh, there's a lot of hype on Yelp over the hibiscus one. Probably gonna start with that one. Here's the hibiscus one. Check that out. Look at that deliciousness. Apparently on top is a hibiscus flower I read online. We're gonna split this in half with me and Stan. There you go. We're doing this marriage style. Yeah, let's Work. do it. Ah. Split it. Nice. Oh, shit. First donut, hibiscus. Let's try it. Let's go. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, That's the reason they're hyping this thing up. Oh my god. That is delicious. That sweetness, that texture, is just the right amount of glaze. It's exactly what you would look in a proper donut to sit down and fill yourself up. And another thing that I read online about dough is that they make small batches of these donuts because they want to make sure that the donuts are super fresh when you come in and get them. So, but they definitely deliver. These are excellent. Super soft, really fresh, and delicious. What more do you want in a donut? I think after one donut, you will be all right. But because we're doing this for you guys, for your entertainment, we're gonna eat them all. So we got three left. Check them out. Bam. So let's do the cheesecake one next. Let's do it. Look at that cheesy goodness. That's the cheesecake donut. Sour cream on top that's whipped. It also has graham crackers on the top. That's what you see right there. Ready? Let's do it. All right. Let's go. Okay, look at it. Oh, 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 God. God. oh God. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> that is creamy. Getting hints of lemon. The gram is just nice and subtle. Definitely very soft. Look how easily it pulls apart. This thing is great. It's really light, actually. I was expecting this one to be a lot heavier than it was. I actually think the hibiscus one was heavier. It seemed like it. The glaze on top of it definitely seemed a little bit thicker than. Even though it looks like a lot of cream, it's very lightweight. So aside from being just hand rolled and hand prepped and everything like that, you know it's coming to you absolutely fresh because the moment they put out the oven, it's right on display. The moment they're coming out to the last few left, they're putting out more right away. Also, I'll be linking the prices for all of these donuts somewhere around here, and I'll definitely link the location to Joe Brooklyn somewhere here. The next donut that we got for you guys is the salted chocolate caramel. Mm, Look at mm, that. Mm, mm, mm. Look at that chocolate goodness. If you like chocolate, you like salted caramel, this is the donut for you. Let's find out. Ready? Baby, I do. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Not a good break this time. Uh, take a break. Go, go, go. Uh, 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 okay, not so much. Oh God, okay. So clearly I'm gonna be the one getting diabetes from this video. I'll be honest though, out of the three that we've tried so far, this is my least favorite, which is odd because I do like chocolate and caramel. It's just, it, it doesn't, it's missing something. I, I don't know what it is, I don't know. I would probably say maybe a little bit more filling on top. Yeah, maybe like, mm -hmm. uh, like if they put, I don't know, vanilla or even Nutella in here, I think that's what would make this donut over the top. Beautiful thing is they do have a Nutella donut that we're probably gonna get next time, but just keep your eyes open. Those things are also really, really good. While Erwin's finishing up, this location that we went to in Lafayette, overall has been standing there for, I believe it opened up in 2010. And I personally have stopped by in that area on multiple occasions. It has a long history. The people in there are pretty lively. You're gonna feel like you're welcomed at home 
just from talking to them. They have great coffee, they have a great assortment. Stop by, check it out. It's still cool. I'm so sure. He, he had nothing. He had nothing. I had to hold on. And the next one, I will probably be the one to introduce it because it might be simple. There you go. It might seem a little basic, but the glaze, the proportions. This is what I look for in a donut when you gotta soothe your soul. You come out, get a nice cup of coffee, you're just chilling out, you had a rough day at work, doesn't matter. You grab this donut, you're gonna be happy. There we go, look at that. Plain glaze. Do. So, to be honest. Ready? One, two, three. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah, pretty I good, pretty good. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> The original glaze, much better. I definitely prefer this one over the salted chocolate caramel. Guys, it's not always about just all the flavors. Sometimes you gotta stick to the original and just be happy. Yeah, they have the right amount of glaze. I mean, it's really soft. This donut is very hearty. I mean, after one or two of these donuts, it's gonna knock you out. The only reason we're having four right now is because we want the viewers, you guys, to know that dough makes quality donuts. If you come here and you buy this box for your friends, family, loved ones, anyone, it's an excellent gift. Who doesn't like donuts? Who doesn't like donuts? Which one was your favorite? I definitely want to say that out of the four donuts, I think the hibiscus one was my favorite. Then I would go with the cheesecake, the glazed, and then I would say probably the salted chocolate caramel. What? What? Are you hating on my glaze? No, it's the truth. I, I like it. The glaze was very I'm good. I'm not gonna argue that. All right, guys, that wraps up today's video about Dough Brooklyn. If you enjoyed this video, smash that thumbs up button. It really helps me out a lot. And if this is your first time to my channel, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Later. Peace.